All right, so it is still Vlogmas, and I have been keeping up with my vlog a day, but I don't really have a whole lot of Christmassy things going on right now, other than the fact that I got an early Christmas present from my mom, and I wanted to show you guys what it is because it's so freaking awesome. You guys wanna see it? So I'm obsessed with Wonder Woman, and my mom got me this Wonder Woman onesie. Oh dear God, I am gonna rock this thing and check this out. It comes with a cape and look, it's got, it doesn't have the feet, but hey, this will be great for cuddling up on the couch with the puppies. So this is what I got. I don't know where she got it, but I'm loving it. And I wanted to do a little bit of another heart to heart video with you guys today. And I wanted to talk about letting yourself go. So there have been a lot of people that I've, speak, I've spoke to lately regarding this topic, and I think it's really interesting, especially for women. I think at one point or another, we go through phases, especially women, we go through these phases where we just let ourselves go, where we just stop caring about our appearance. We take on that screw it mentality, and that screw it mentality stems so much further than poor nutrition and lack of activity. It stems further to like a laziness in your mind. It stems further to a just a huge sense of self neglect. That could be hygiene, that could be, you know, you're not shaving your legs, that could be you're not making yourself presentable and attractive for your significant other. That could just be a general level of not caring anymore not wanting to look at yourself in the mirror, not wanting to address how certain clothes are fitting you anymore, not wanting to look at what you look like naked, and just an overall downward cycle. And I think that that's very relevant and real for a lot of people, and I think a lot of people aren't talking about it because clearly I wanna to talk to you guys about very matter-of-fact things like how to calculate your macros, some very specific science-based tips on this channel, and all of that's still coming. You're gonna keep getting more of that content, but I still want to address the human side of that, and I want to encourage any women specifically right now who just feel like they have let themselves go that there is a huge difference between indulging in pleasure and an overall sense of self-neglect. Because I find that once you begin to neglect yourself, if you're always constantly putting yourself last, putting yourself last, not allowing yourself to get enough sleep, not allowing yourself to drink enough water, not allowing yourself to have enough good quality food, always putting, whether it's your children, your job, your significant other, your family, your parents, um, the needs of others ahead of yourself. I think that a lot of women have a tendency to just want to give and give and give and they're so caring and so awesome and so nurturing and those are all great qualities. But sometimes it gets to the point where you just keep putting yourself last and at the end of the day that's not a good thing because i believe you cannot pour from an empty cup and if you are just so drained taking care of others it's easy to put yourself last it's easy to just completely forget and neglect yourself but there's a huge difference between enjoying a glass of wine every once in a while enjoying a higher calorie meal once in a while and in taking those moments to enjoy life versus just having complete and utter disregard for your health, for your well-being, for for your for what's going to be good for you. So, if you fall into that category where you know what, you know, you're just not liking how you feel lately. Every woman has a pair of jeans that just fits a certain way, and if that magical pair of jeans is just not fitting you anymore, and you're just wearing baggier and baggier and baggier clothing to address it, I encourage you guys to take an eyes wide open approach and to do something about it. And it could be something as simple as starting with, go shave your legs, go get your nails and toes done, like exfoliate your whole body, put your makeup on, you know, like spray some nice perfume on and just feel like a, the best version of you given where you are with what you got right now. And I think there's just so much to be said for that. I, I just get disheartened when I see a ton of self-neglect. 
It's not selfish to take care of yourself, you guys. You cannot pour from an empty cup. Let me repeat this. You cannot pour from an empty cup. So I just want to encourage you guys to take good care of yourself. And one more thing before I log off and end the video. I thought it was seriously cool for the video I uploaded the other day. I noticed in the discussion or in the comments that somebody shared a little bit of their story and then I find on YouTube there's just a lot of trolls <laughs> and some people can say some really mean things but for some reason on this channel it was really cool because somebody shared something personal about them and how they were struggling and then there were a couple other people who just commented positivity and I just want to thank you guys for doing that because that's what I'm all about and I love that that's being perpetuated even in the comments that there's forming a sense of community here on this YouTube channel. Obviously I have the Gage Girl Training community which is, you can learn more about me on Periscope, I'm on there all the time or join my private Facebook group where you can get direct access and I pop on there a lot too. I just thought it was seriously cool how there was just an, a sense of encouragement in the comments and I know that's a, such a small subtle thing but it's actually not because there is just so much craziness that happens on YouTube comments where like it's just insane but I thought that was cool and I just want to encourage you guys to get out of your funk and to begin to stop neglecting yourself and take those baby steps you guys take those baby steps even if it's something as simple as cutting down the alcohol a little bit drinking some more water start with taking care of your appearance you know like sometimes i pop on here and have my makeup on i don't have my hair done nice but you know like i need to I need to work on that too sometimes because i feel i feel good when i do that but at the same time there are times i'll pop on these videos without makeup because i care more about the quality of the content that i'm giving you than spending an extra hour on my hair because i got this thick ass hair so I'm, I'm just trying to bring you guys authentic content i just really appreciate you guys uh, support and thank you for watching. I'm going to enjoy my Wonder Woman PJs. I love everything Wonder Woman by the way. So and my mom goes to me, oh look there's a there's a cape but it's detachable. I said oh no the cape is staying on. <laughs> Alright guys I'll see you in the next one. Please subscribe to the channel and give this video a thumbs up. Thanks guys.